Mikhail Emre Chalishka, uh, Chief Executive Officer at Bixos, are with us, Crypto KTV. What inspired you to enter in blockchain industry? Since I started the blockchain, it was uh, 2015, I didn't actually know what I was doing. So uh, I decided to dive deep into blockchain, see what I am doing really. I'm trading some coins, but I don't know what was it. So I made some research and I see that it was really something will change the world. And it did it actually. So that inspired me and uh, make my movement, uh, make my living with it. That's it. Can you explain how Bixos crypto payment getaway integrates with existing um, e-commerce platforms and what benefits it offers to merchants uh, and uh, consumers? Yeah, it's uh, one of our uh, biggest project is crypto payment gateway. So it will be merged with uh, multiple shopping uh, solutions such as uh, WordPress and some and other e-commerce uh, websites. We also creating plugins for them. And also, how to say, it's the benefit is uh, low transaction fees and more uh, crypto payment uh, solutions. More coins you can trade with it or you can get uh, purchase with it. Yeah. How has the real estate NFT convers conversion project be uh, been recei received by uh, property owners and investors and what are some of the challenges faced in integrating blockchain technology with traditional real estate uh, practices? Actually, uh, we convert real estate ownership to the NFT. So the main asset is kept in the company. Company holds the assets. People just trade the real estate, buy and sell, maybe a fractional part of it, share it ownership, so on. The biggest challenge here is the trust. How we will gain the people trust. Actually, it's, uh, we have also uh, in Turkey a big community that people who believe us and uh, most of people in Turkey they like to invest in real estate so we see in Turkey is the big market is climbing rapidly in real estate but the return is very low actually so it's hard for Turkish people to go abroad most uh, most of time needs a visa and this visa uh, process is uh, sometimes taking too long and that's why we created this project uh, we will start our beta in Turkey and uh, Turkish people can buy property from abroad and then we will expand our uh, coverage areas. Can you explain more about NFT stake words and how it benefits users who hold NFTs? Yeah, uh, one of our project is NFT stake. We see in this stake, uh, maybe you know the stake is uh, when you stake your coins or assets, uh, you need to keep it in certain periods of time. So in this time period, it might be long, six months, one year. So the users need to take back their asset. Maybe he need it, uh, maybe he will use it for another uh, conversion, for another trade. But we see that there is a big uh, problem about here. Because uh, traditional banking system, there is a solution. They cut their commission and they give, you, they give back your money. But the, here is the stake mostly working with smart contracts. It's very difficult to, uh, how to say, manipulate the smart contract. Almost impossible when you invest in some certain period. Six months, it's uh, certainly six months. So here is, you can keep the uh, staking in, uh, as an NFT also. So in this case, if you need to, for example, convert it to back uh, or you want to take back your asset, so you can sell to someone else. There is this opportunity with NFT stake. What challenges has Bixo faced in the development and the implementation of its blockchain-enabled solutions and how has the company overcome them? Actually, we have good developers. Uh, so is the most of our uh, developers they know uh, how blockchain works they know the uh, code bases of blockchain and that's why uh, most of things is not a challenge for us the big challenge is uh, mostly is financial and uh, to get community for marketing we know what we do but uh, to expand the business uh, we need more uh, marketing and more uh, people must hear us <laughs> yeah <laughs> so, the Civic 
project uh, or a case study where big so solutions have uh, made a significant impact on a client or industry? Yeah, actually, uh, Vixos has some signal. Yeah, from the beginning, uh, when we start in Turkey, we see some uh, attention on this project, our real estate on NFT, on blockchain. Uh, because, uh, as I said before, uh, people in Turkey, they like to invest in real estate mostly. And uh, they want to invest in abroad for uh, sustainable investment and, and other things. That's why... Uh, yeah, we created this project and we continue our project. We we will continue our job. That's it. Mikael, thank you so much for your interview at Crypto KTV and I wish you good luck and I wish that all the people know your company. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Thank you. Thank you very much.